We work closely with the National Weather Service every day to bring you the most accurate forecast. And today marks a new chapter for the federal government agency. Dr. Ussolini, the most recent director, has been retired and he's been replaced by a familiar face. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration officially announced Ken Graham as the new director of the National Weather Service. And it's incredibly humbling to think that I've gone from intern to now, now director of the, the Weather Service. It's just, I'm, I'm still soaking in, honestly. Graham really did start from the very bottom. He was an intern at the Weather Forecasting Office in New Orleans in 1994. Over the years, he's worked his way through the National Weather Service, gaining extensive knowledge about weather and disasters along the way. The name Ken Graham might sound familiar. He was most recently the director of the National Hurricane Center, helping the country prepare for some of the most dangerous weather. In his new role, it won't just be hurricanes, but every type of weather across the entire United States. In the end, we're here to, to really protect lives and property for everyone. With significant weather events becoming more frequent and impactful, Graham wants to use his new role to look inward. He wants to make sure forecasters across the country are taken care of during challenging times. You look at how much weather we've had, from fires to hurricanes to floods, uh, heat, we've had winter weather, and, and to be able to do that and keep ourselves safe so we can keep America safe. That's not easy, and I'm really going to be open and, and talk about that. Graham is now officially the 17th director of the National Weather Service and says he, quote, can't wait to get started. And the National Weather Service headquarters, where Ken Graham will be located, is actually here in the DMV. It's in Silver Spring in Maryland. It's going to be All important right. work. Yeah. Mm -hmm.